consider the subspace W of the vector space R10, the dimension of W is. So, dimension of vector space R10, R10 dimension is 10 and how many independent condition we have as condition in compact form or in a formula structure is written as xn equals to xn minus 1 plus xn minus 2 and this is true for when n is belonging to this inequality means n is n is 3 or greater than 3 and less than or equals to 10. So how many condition we have x3 can be written as x2 plus x1 x4 can be written as x3 plus x2, x5, and x6, x7, x8, 9, 10. It means we have 10 independent uh, condition. So 10 minus, sorry, we have 8 independent condition. So 10 minus 8 equals to 2. So dimension of W will be 2. But uh, in another way, we can uh, generalize how we can tell dimension if someone is not know this trick as x4 also can be written as sum of x3 plus x2 it means x2 plus x1 plus x2 x5 also means sum of x4 plus x3 and x4 can be written as like this and x3 is also sum of x1 and x2 means are all coming terms greater than 3 uh, all terms uh, after third term will be the sum of first uh, sum of x1 and x2 means if we have this uh, interpolate like this x1 x2 and so on up to x10 x1 is at their place x2 is also x3 is sum of x1 plus x2 and other also sum of x1 and x2 so we have x1 and x2 are independent choices to write uh, this element of subspace so dimension is at how many position we are independent to write any element of the subspace we are independent at two places so dimension will will be two